हेलो एवरी वन एंड वेलकम टू अवर डिशिप फाइनेंस एंड ऑपरेशन मॉड्यूल बाइज ट्रेनिंग सीरीज सो इन अवर प्रीवियस एपिसोड वी डिस्कस अबाउट द लाइन डिस्काउंट एंड मल्टी लाइन डिस्काउंट ट्रेड एग्रीमेंट इफ यू डोंट वॉच दिस एपिसोड जस्ट गो बैक एंड वॉच दिस एपिसोड देन यू कैन कंटिन्यू विद दिस न्यू एपिसोड सो इन दिस न्यू एपिसोड वी डिस्कस अबाउट द टोटल डिस्काउंट फीचर इन डिशिप फाइनेंस एंड ऑपरेशन सो द टोटल डिस्काउंट इज अनलाइक टू द लाइन डिस्काउंट एंड मल्टी लाइन डिस्काउंट इट्स अप्लाइड टू द टोटल वैल्यू ऑफ द परचेस ऑर्डर Total discount is not directly associated with the any of the purchase order line, whereas directly applied to the purchase order value itself. So let's first set up the total discount trade agreement journal name. So we again go to procurement and sourcing collapse all inside setup. We have price and discount set trade agreement journal. Let's create a total discount journal name. Select the total discount as a description and change the relation to the total discount. save this form and you need to make sure that you have enable the prices and discount from the total discount otherwise the total discount is not applicable for the purchase order so let's enable this parameter on hit the save button now let's create the trade agreement journal for the total discount so let's collapse inside prices and discount trade agreement journal names click on the new here we select our total discount so description and the relation is auto populated now we'll just add the lines for the total discount here we select the vendor let's select the vendor which we have created the previous limited if you want to apply the total discount for the all the vendor then you can select the party code type to the all here inside the product type code for the item you will find the major difference that here we option have only all but for the line discount we have option like group all and the item for the multi line discount we have option like group and all but for the total discount we have only one option that is all which means that when we select the total discount trade agreement it's applicable for the all the item in the purchase order so let's add the discount of 5% save this journal validate selected line let's post this journal after posting this additional setup inside the item master let's go to item master we go to product information management release product inside release product select any item for which you want to apply the total discount so let's select this we click on the edit button and enable this toggle for the total discount so only after this enabling total discount for the purchase you will get the total discount for the purchase order level so let's create the purchase order now click on the new select the vendor for which we have enable the total discount select the pws limited select any warehouse select the item for which we have set the total discount so we'll set the discount for the mid range speaker let's save this at similar to the multi line discount the total discount is also not auto populated we need to go to purchase tab and make sure you need to hit the total discount button So let's click on the total discount button. So here still the discount is not populated on the line level, but you can see in the purchase order header, header level the 50% of our discount is now applicable for the all purchase order line. So you can also see the discount in the total. So we'll click on the purchase order inside totals. Our total discount on 50%, which considered as a 150 1.36, is applicable over purchase order. So the total discount will be display over here. And if our purchase order have any line discount, so you can see the line discounts in the line discount column. So that's it for the total discount. So in our next videos, we discuss about the purchase order creation process. So stay tuned with us, and thank you for watching.